Hey guys, welcome back, so let's play Pokemon Blue. And once we go through this door, we're gonna fight the final boss. Jimmy! Oh my goodness! This room looks really unepic. Hey! I was looking forward to seeing you, Johnny! My rival should be as strong to keep me sharp. While working on the Pokedex, I looked all over for powerful Pokemon. Not only that, I assembled teams that would beat any Pokemon type. And now, I'm the Pokemon League champion. Johnny, do you know what that means? I'll tell you. I'm the most powerful trainer in the world. Is that true? Is it really true? Well, by judging by his jacket, I'd say so. Alright, so we got take down Jimmy. Jimmy's gonna start out first with his Pidgeot. This thing is strong as crap and fast. So we're gonna have to send out Jimmy. I mean, not Jimmy. We're gonna send out Boney. Use Thunder Wave and take. Make that thing slow as dirt. Alright, let's use Mirror Move. Use Thunder Wave too. Wow, didn't really see that coming. <laughs> so I'm gonna have to use a full. Eh, whatever. Screw it. I don't care. So we're just gonna be parallel. Okay, so I was using Whirlwind for some really dumb reason. I don't know why. That's really weird. Yes, I actually do need a full heal though. So, okay. <laughs> Start off the battle still using items. I don't want to get here through here without using items. We'll only use like two in a max potion. Yeah, use mirror move thunderbolt again. Well, dude, I'm a electric type. Don't really think it's gonna be doing a ton of, a ton of damage to me. All right, man, you gotta love this ape theme. It's like the best. I'd say it's one of the best in Pokemon history. But well, that's not obvious. It's a final boss battle. Okay, so we take one down. Oh my gosh, Alakazam is the Alakazam's the problem in this. So we're gonna send out Dynablade as a fodder. Ooh, this thing is fast and strong. It's just going to do all sorts of stuff to us. That we're not particularly going to like, so I'm going to try and get a Toxic up. Okay, so we got Toxic. Yes! Alright, so... Alakazam can recover, right? Well, that's good and all. I can fly. Oh, great. Well, it's just Psychic. Great! Great! That's going to win hit kill Donna Blade 100%. Cool for you, man. Cool for you. Alright, so we're just going to have to whittle down this Alakazam to the best of our ability. So I'm going to try and launch a Slash attack at it. A Slash... Ooh, great. He is going to take down Waka. Ooh, great. Wow, he survived. Sweet. Alright. <laughs> Alright, that good. good damage, good damage. Alright, so I'm going to risk it. Okay, set up Reflect. That's good and all, but if I remember... My slashes will go through Reflect, so I kind of set this up to work. Yes! Yes! Alright, we took down his best Pokemon. Well, second best Pokemon. So, alright, now that Alakazam is gone, he's going to send out Weaklings again. <laughs> like his Rhydon, which we can easily take down Cooper. Oh, that was like, I was most afraid of the whole game. Because really, n not a lot can beat Alakazam. Like, really, unless we have, like, Earthquake or Body Slam, maybe, or if you put statuses on it. But yeah, physical attacks are the way to go if you want to take down an Alakazam. I could have really gone into Nocturia and put it to sleep, but I couldn't really use Dream Eater in that situation, so I really didn't want to do that. It kind of sucks the whole game I didn't really get to use Dream Eater, but uh, am I speaking too soon? Who knows? All right. So we're going to send Boney out here to take down this Gyarados. Kind of lame that two trainers in the final area use Gyaradoses, but oh well, still a really cool Pokemon, even though it can't be taken down simply by a Thunderbolt. It's <laughs> so, all right. Bye-bye, Gyarados. So, if I remember, he should have two Pokemon remaining. But where are they? Arcanine! His Growlithe finally evolved. Alright, so, Nocturia, this is your time to shine. So, we're gonna try and put this Arcanine to sleep, and just Dream Eat from there, so. I, I gotta use it one time, I mean, I taught it to him, and wow, seriously, you're level 63 and using Ember. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, a Hypnosis will not go to shame, and I, I wanna see how much damage this. Wow. You really don't want me to use that attack, do you? Man, Nocturia can take takedowns all day. You can take those takedowns. Man. Oh, uh, great. I actually lied. You can't take takedowns. Nobody get mad at me, but I'm going to use a full heal. Yeah, might as well use full restore. I don't care, really. <laughs> I didn't really use items at all in this area. It's kind of weird. Leaf 4 usually gives me a lot of trouble. All right, so I just don't crit. I want. I, I got to use Dream Eater at least once. Such a cool move. That's a hypnosis, and you're gonna leer. That's cool. I missed hypnosis two times in a row. At least he missed his stinking roar. 
Alright, so we put the Ark in our sleep. So now we're finally gonna see that stupid move of a try use the whole game. Alright, so we're gonna eat his dreams, literally. Come here. Ugh, Nocturious signature attack, which did barely any damage. Oh, I'm gonna keep eating. I can taste them. I bet they, I bet they, I bet they taste like caramel. Caramel apples. Yeah. That's how these dreams do. <laughs> getting really weird. Alright, so we're just sapping his health away. I feel like he's gonna wake up. Eh, he didn't. So let's launch our psychic attack at it. Mm. Now Arcanine's taken down. Now Jim is gonna send out his last Pokemon. But not before we get a level up. Alright. Jim is gonna send out his Venusaur. Now this Venusaur has given me trouble in the past. And it might give me trouble today since it's level 65. Way higher level than anything else we have. So, I'm gonna start off with a confused raid. This will be two final boss fights I've actually used nine tails in in the history of my video game Let's Play channel. Oh my goodness, you were sucking my L HP out. Not my LP out. Give me my HP out, so I'm not gonna. F now that he's confused, I'm gonna launch Fire Blast. Miss one. That's okay. I'm not really too mad about that. Because now the next one's gonna hit. Nope, Venusaur is still confused. Are we really matched for speed? That's really odd. Alright, so the Venusaur is hitting itself in confused. Fire Blast missed twice. Alright, I'm going to Flamethrower. <laughs> Come on, hit yourself again. That'd be so. Ah, dang. Well, good thing about Gray Fox is. That's how I resist to Omega Drains. I really do not want him to use Solar Beam, though, because I feel like that could actually take somebody out here. I'm surprised he's not actually using Razor Leaf. Do I speak too soon? I guess not. <laughs> well, come on, Jimmy. You're kind of just letting me have this victory. You put up a little bit more of a fight. I mean, Pete's sake, you got almost 20 levels on me. Oh, well. <laughs> We've beaten the strongest trainer in all of Kanto. Or rival Jimmy. All right. Beat my best! After all, I work to become the league champ. My reign is over already. It's not fair! <laughs> you give some money. Why? Why did I lose? I never made any mistakes except making my Arcanine almost all my Pokemon really stupid moves. <laughs> Darn it, you're the new Pokemon League champ. Although, I don't like to admit it. <laughs> Yummy! Well, hey, Oak, what's up? What's. So here's another way. So you won. Congratulations. You're the new Pokemon League Champion. You've grown up so much since you first left with Squirtle. <laughs> Johnny, you've come of age, even though you're the exact same age since this only took like a month. Jimmy, I'm disappointed. I came when I heard you beat the Elite Four. But when I got here, you had already lost. Pete's sake, you suck. Jimmy, do you understand why you lost? You suck. Do I have to repeat myself? Without them, you will never become a champ again. Johnny, you understand that your victory was not just yours. The bond you share with your Pokemon is marvelous. Johnny, come with me. Okay. Just go in this random room I've never been in my life with an old man. No problem. <clears throat> Congratulations, Johnny. This floor is the Pokemon Hall of Fame. Pokemon League champions are honored for their exploits here. Yeah. Their Pokemon are also recorded in the Hall of Fame. Johnny, you have endeavored hard to become the new League Champion. Congratulations, you and your Pokemon are Hall of Famers! <laughs> yes. So alright guys, that's the end of the game. We have completed every single challenge in the game, except capturing the legendary Pokemon, which... If enough people bug me to do, I guess I will do, but it really doesn't make sense for me to do that. I feel like I should just go on to the next Let's Play. Take care of that. Yeah, so we get a roll call here of our marvelous Pokemon that helped me through this adventure. Honestly, I liked this team. I liked everybody's nicknames. I thought they were all pretty creative, except for Grey Fox. <laughs> I tried to name them, like, after video game characters. Eh, I kind of kept that theme going on a little bit, but not entirely. With Nocturri, I really didn't have anything to name it after. Though. So, yeah, I, I really enjoyed this Let's Play, guys. It was very nostalgic. I, I still gotta say the first generation of Pokemon is my favorite. Simply maybe because of the fact I just like psychic type so much. Eh, that's probably it. I don't know if we'll be coming back to this generation, though, on my channel, however. Because, I mean, what's left to do? Yeah, we, we've seen almost 150 Pokemon. That's crazy. Pokedex rating, you still need a can't more Pokemon. Well, shut up. That's my response. So, yeah, guys, I was actually really pleased with the way this turned out. And, yeah, here's the credits. My next LP, however. This is, hands down, my most requested LP. And it is something I've put off for a very long time just because I didn't feel like I would do it right. 
I didn't feel like my commentary would be good enough. But I guarantee you, I'm going to try so hard to make this the best LP ever. I say that every time. I was like, this is going to be the best LP ever. No. You don't understand me. Okay? This is going to be the best LP ever. Now, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? Well, I don't know. I'm just going to let it go by itself, and I'm going to just try focus on commentary and gameplay and make the best dang enjoyable LP ever. Make it funny as heck. And just like, hey, and you know, it's, it's gonna, it's gonna be the best. Do I know that? No, but I'm gonna strive for comp. I'm gonna strive for quality and just make it enjoyable. Cause I really don't, I, I, I really don't say it enough, guys. But thank you so much for watching my videos. This has become a hobby that is unlike any other. Honestly, it's, it's really cool. It's, it's. There's really nothing like it. You know, you play a video game. Like, I've said it before, it's like, it's like I'm playing a game, and then some guys are like, man, I remember this, this is like the best game ever, you know? And that's just cool, I mean, that can connect with people, and people are like, dude, I remember that, it was, uh, you know, it was like the hardest boss of I ever, and I'm like, dude, I know, right? And, you know, it's, that's just cool, and uh, g going through my life, I didn't really think a lot of people really played video games like I did, but here on YouTube, that, everybody loves it, so... I mean, that's just that's just cool to me. But yeah, that's Pokemon Blue version. Uh, there's nothing really left to do in the game. So guys, I'll see you in the next Let's Play. See you later.